Hey guys, so I have a gluten-free haul video for you. I just got a order from Vitacost in the mail today, so I figured I would just film it for you and show you what I got because I get so many questions asking what sorts of gluten-free products that I get. I get them all on Vitacost because they are way cheaper than Sprouts and Whole Foods. It's just so expensive if you buy all your gluten-free stuff there. So the first thing that I got is some cereal. This is the Puffins peanut butter cereal by Barbara's and I used to eat this all the time in high school or not high school in college it's just really really good it goes by really quickly though it's the only thing but I haven't had this in so many years so I felt like getting this again then I got some of these breakfast bars I have had these before I got the um, variety pack so this is gluten free all natural and they're called rise breakfast bar and I got the, the flavor crunchy macadamia pineapple they come like this so these are just so good for breakfast they are just like they have the most real raw ingredients it's just macadamias honey pineapples raisins sesame seeds organic amaranth crisp rice and salt and that is it then I got the bakery on main maple multi-grain muffin oatmeal this is so good I've actually had this before I got this at sprouts and it was like I want to say it was six dollars it was just really expensive so when I saw that they started selling this on body cost I was so happy it has um, whole grain certified gluten-free oats chia flax amaranth and quinoa in here and it just, I mean, it tastes like a muffin. It's delicious. Then I got some gluten-free pancake mix. It's the King Arthur flour brand. I've never tried this before, but Andrew like loves waffles and pancakes and all that, and we never, ever have it, so I felt like getting this. Hopefully it's good. We'll see. So if you guys have tried this brand, let me know. So this is a Gluteno gluten-free pantry double chocolate brownie. And these are the most delicious brownies ever. They don't even taste like gluten-free. They would... Like, you can't even tell. I made these one night and me and Andrew ate them in like a day. They were just amazing. They're so good. They have chocolate chips in them. And they use, what do they use instead? They use rice flour. Then in here they put, they package like your wet ingredients in here usually. So I got some Silk Pure Almond Vanilla Almond Milk. I like using almond milk for my smoothies. Like when I make smoothies with raspberries and blueberries, like berries, it's really good with some almond milk, ice, yogurt, that sort of thing, protein powder. And then I got some soup. This is the organic hearty tomato bisque. I just thought this was really good. It's by Pacific and it's organic and I mean it just has like tomatoes and spices in here. So it looks good and I love tomato soup. I had tomato soup last night. These are the Coco Cafes. These are so good. It is coconut water and espresso and you just shake it up and it's just delicious. I like drinking these because I feel like I get kind of dehydrated when I drink coffee all the time. So this has coconut water in there, so you're getting the hydration at the same time. Oh, I got the wrong one. Dang it. So these are the Blue Monkey Pure Coconut Water. These are me and Andrew's all-time favorite brand of coconut water. But we get the one without pulp, and this is with pulp. So I might need to order some more, but they're so good. It's just the best coconut water I've ever tried and you should try it. I ordered some flour recently from Vitacost and I can't remember what kind, I know it was this brand, this is the Bob's Red Mill brand of flour and I know it was this brand but I can't remember what kind of flour it was. So I got the tapioca flour but it feels like really, I don't think this was it. I don't know, maybe it was but we got some sort of gluten-free flour and it was so good you couldn't even taste it. So I'm hoping this is good too, we will see. But please, whatever your favorite, like gluten-free flour, rice flour, whatever, let me know because I'm always on the hunt to find a good gluten-free flour. It's pretty hard. Then I got some more Kind Bars. These are my favorite kind. It is the Cranberry Almond and Antioxidants. They're so good. They have macadamia nuts in here, cranberries, almonds. Delicious. So if you guys have not tried these, you need to. They have, how many are in here? 12, I'm guessing. They're just so good. So, so good. And you can buy these at Starbucks. They sell them there all the time, but they're like two bucks at Starbucks and you get a whole, you get, how many are in here? 12. And I think these are usually like $16 or so. I got some Blue Diamond Natural Almond Nut Thins and these are the Pepper Jack Cheese flavor. I've tried the almond ones before, but not the flavored ones, so hopefully they're good. The other ones are really good and they are 
wheat and gluten free. I have two more things. I got some soup. This is the Amy's Organic Soup Lentil. I love lentil soup. Lentil soup is like my all time favorite soup. So we will see how this is. The one from Trader Joe's is my all time favorite. It is delicious. I saved the best for last. These are my favorite chips ever. I don't care if you even eat gluten free food. It is just, these are so good. I think these are gluten free, are they? Yeah. So they're the kettle chips and they're the barbecue, organic countryside barbecue. They're just so good. I swear I could eat a whole pack of these right now. Easy. But I mean, if you're going to have chips, it's better have these. They're zero trans fat, no preservatives, gluten free, non GMO, made with all natural ingredients. So highly suggest these. The other ones that I am obsessed with from um, Vitacost are the, I tell everybody to get these, what are they called? The Boulder Canyon, they're from Colorado, Boulder Canyon salt and pepper chips. They're so good. So that is everything that I got. I hope you guys got a couple little things to try out. Um, if you are, if you do eat gluten free, it is kind of hard sometimes. I know they have a ton of gluten free stuff out there, but a lot of it is disgusting. So, um, hi. But yeah, let us all know in the comments what your favorite gluten free products are because, again, a lot of people ask me what my favorites are. So if you leave just a few of your favorites, I know it'll help a ton of people out. And I think that is it. I hope you guys all have a good rest of your day, and I will see you all soon. Bye. What do you think? Say bye.